about 45 minutes ago, we saw an incredible moment live and in person right here outside of the Texas State softball field. Now to fully grasp what happened in that moment, you have to understand the full story. It's one that started over a decade ago here in San Marcos, took us up north to Georgetown and then ended back in San Marcos today in this exact spot. Game worn cleats for softball. In a one story home on the north side of Georgetown, Tom Madden collects sports history. Here's a baseball team in 1905. Mementos, monuments, memories. It's a beautiful jersey. Most from his alma mater. Got Texas State uh, baseball, I've got football. But the four foot wooden chair that currently holds part of a softball uniform will soon be empty. Being number eight, it was significant during that time of the year. Years ago, Tom won this 2013 game worn jersey in a charity auction. Things you pick up on fundraisers, anything to help the university. But the present uh, owner wants to give a present to the past. Found out through social media that Anna Hernandez, this is her currently or this was her game worn jersey. Honestly, I made a Facebook post about it. I didn't think it would catch wind like it did. And when I saw her in that picture, that number eight jersey, and I said, oh, I know who's got that jersey and it's me. Something was wearing away at the player who used to wear the jersey. I've just become more nostalgic over time. So I got really curious where the jersey I wore for majority of the time while I was playing, where it went. Ana Hernandez, a four year starter and all conference infielder, has a home in Texas state history. Now she wants a part of Texas state history in her home. Somebody on Twitter caught up on it and they threw it out, threw her Facebook page out saying she was looking for it. I had this feeling that I knew it was close. I just had to find the person who had it. That's when I decided to make contact and say, hey, Anna, I got your jersey. <laughs> an online conversation led to an on campus connection. Today's a day that um, I'm going to get this jersey back that I've been, um, I guess, on the hunt for for about 10 years now. So a hand delivery. <laughs> Hi, Tom. Do you recognize it? Yes, that your that's my number. Are yes. Sure? Not for a price, but for a purpose. This thing she'll be handing out to her kids or grandkids, possibly. You know, me, it's just going to hang on a chair. That's hers. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, you bet. Thank yeah. you. A collector of sports memories and a composer of sports memories combined to create. It's exactly how I remember it. Just that. And again, it's full circle, just having this jersey back in my hand, so I really appreciate you taking care of it. Oh, yeah. Yes, sir. Well, guys, what you just saw there was the first time Tom and Anna ever met. After that jersey exchange, Anna turned around. She was going to leave the stadium and go home, maybe stream the game from there. But Tom said, wait, wait, wait. He saved one of his season tickets, the one for tonight's game, right next to him for her. Of course, they went inside and took a picture together with the jersey. I posted that picture on my Twitter page, at Jeff Jones Sports.